Dear colleagues, first of all, I would like to thank you, the rapporteurs, for the work done and praise uh, uh, them also for reflecting a thematic and comprehensive analysis in their reports. Uh, protecting human rights represents the cornerstone in building a genuine democracy society and human rights defenders are among the main actors uh, in creating, maintaining and uh, polishing up uh, uh, when it needed to be um, in a supporting environment. I don't think that it would be an exaggeration to say that the last decades two decades were amongst the most turbulent in the recent history of our continent. Europe is still witnessing profound geopolitical transformation, in particular instability revolving around borders and outbreaks of violent conflicts. As a result, my country continues to be concerned about the human rights situation in the Transnistrian region uh, of the Republic of Moldova. To, uh, due to the unsolved conflict, the region remains outside the monitoring process of national and international human rights mechanisms. In terms of ensuring outreach, visibility and dissemination of international standards of human rights, the region remains an unexploited territory. Furthermore, I would like to refer to the alleged stigmatization and criminal procedures against the human rights fighters, the association Promolex, which is one of the most important human rights defenders in the uh, Transnistrian region. The Promolex activity in the area of human rights is well known. The most relevant fields of their activity include the, the fight for the rights to education, freedom of security, freedom of movement, right to property, right to life, prohibition of torture and other cruel treatment, right to the fair trial, uh, fight against uh, domestic violence, freedom of associations. For its efforts, including the promotion and defense of human rights in the Transnistria region, the association was awarded by national and international institutions. The authority of the Republic of Moldova undertook a number of actions uh, to protect the rights of uh, Promolex activists against abuses of um, Transnistrian, uh, so-called Transnistrian structures. But uh, uh, these are not always sufficient. A number of requests were sent out to international partners involved in the negotiation process, uh, um, processes on the Transnistrian settlement in order to have an objective stance of the difficult situation on human rights and jobs from the region, challenges they face when providing counseling to inhabitants from the left bank of the Nistru River, as well as for containing for um, contracting foreign support to improve the existing situation. Finally, I would like to point out that the Republic of Moldova will further continue making efforts to support the civil society representatives in the process of promoting the activities for ensuring the human rights protection in Transnistrian region. Despite all the problems in addressing the issue of human rights defenders, we all have to remember that they are those who bring the changes and make a difference on the ground in their day-by-day -day activity despite all the impediments and obstacles. Thank you.